We live in a society where a meme can make it into another mainstream movie. Alright, so I've been on record on this channel nonetheless stating how I was worried about the Snyder Cut, well, Zack Snyder's Justice League. I was very worried because everything was coming out at a fast rate, and I was worried that this was going to fail. Looking back on it now, I think I was overreacting because the trailer didn't even come out yet. But after the trailer that was presented to us at DC Fandom, and this one, I'm excited. This looks very promising but I've gotten hyped over DC and Star Wars trailers and normally end up with a average or underwhelming movie, but I want this to succeed because it looks like Zack Snyder put his all into this. And like I've said before, I'm just happy that Zack is getting to give us his full, uncut, untouched vision. Not really much to talk about because we know the general plot of the movie, so I'll go over the couple things that I really did like. Also, before I forget, Alfred had the best line in the trailer, by the way. If you can't bring down the charging bull, then don't wave the red cape at it. Batman did more in both trailers than the entirety of 2017's version of Justice League, actually fighting back instead of standing around turning himself into a joke. Darkseid looks amazing. I have a love-hate relationship with some of Snyder's designs. I like some of the things that he did for Krypton and Man of Steel, and some things that he did in Batman v Superman I liked, but I'm still not a big fan of his Doomsday design. I feel like that could have been worked on. But Darkseid, Desaad, Steppenwolf, and I think that's grainy goodness behind Darkseid in that nightmare sequence, looks great. Side note, if I don't see him shoot at least one Omega Beam at someone, I'm going to be disappointed. Black Suit Superman looks amazing. I know Snyder fought to get that in the original film, but from what I've heard, the studio didn't want it in there. So I'm glad it's here. Also, looks like Zack is trying to recreate the first flight scene from Man of Steel which is amazing by the way, people need to give that movie some more credit. I'm hoping we get more Cyborg here, I'm pretty sure we will because Snyder did say that he was going to be the heart of the film. I'm sad that he's not going to be in the Flash movie anymore, but I hope he has a lot more to do here. We didn't hear much from Aquaman, Flash, Commissioner Gordon, or Deathstroke, I think he's in this movie too. Also before I forget, Jared Leto's Joker look, it's grown on me. I'm just glad we got rid of the tattoos and the grills. And I'm just glad the studio gave him a second chance. But that's what the movie's for, like I said. This is four hours, so every character should be fully utilized. While I'm on that subject, I just hope this movie is paced well. While I do think the Ultimate Edition of Batman v Superman is better than the theatrical release of the movie, and I know they had to flesh everything out, but I felt like the pacing was really, really slow there. So I know I shouldn't even compare it to this, but maybe pace it like Endgame, mostly where it doesn't feel like 4 hours but you get everything fully fleshed out, not asking you to be breakneck speed, but well balanced. So I'm gonna leave that there, let me know what you thought about the trailer for Zack Snyder's Justice League, did you love it, did you hate it, I've seen a lot of people have been really mixed on this, so sound off in the comments, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Also I want to thank all of you for 1.1k views on that, here we go edit, I didn't even like the video that much, but I put it out and it went higher and higher, it went higher than I thought it would, and I didn't even think it would, so thank you guys for that. Also thank you to everyone who subscribed in the past two weeks, that really means a lot to me. I will get back to filming new videos, I'm working on new videos as we speak, so yeah that's your channel update for this month. So as always I appreciate you guys for watching this video, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see more content like this in the future, be sure to leave a like and subscribe, join the family, help the channel grow. Also hit the bell icon and set the notifications to all so you never miss a video. Love you guys, stay safe, continue to spread nothing but peace, love, and positivity, and I will see you guys next time. This has been the Web Warrior, signing off.